Hello everyone, my name is Fungusen and welcome back to this Imperator Rome Purple Phoenix campaign. So, we're about to... well, we are at war. We're not about to do anything. We are about to get more troops though for this war. So, let's just keep the ball rolling. These have all been let loose, so they should be doing something useful. I will gladly take the free stability. I'm actually getting to a slightly normal amount of stability now, so think we'll be doing fine. What do you want? Well, <laughs> we are going to lose said stability straight away because who needs it anyway? Now I am tempted to just let these... Um, oh, that was quick. Uh, take these ones and drop them off here on the coast and they can, I don't know, start coming in from that direction. We'll see. Really? Ah, uh, there's a lot of them. You might actually want to help out, yes. And you might want to move reasonably quickly. I mean, the troops are pathetic to be fair, but still, there we go. Much better. Uh, in the meantime, get on the boats. And get up there, and we'll be getting those ones as well. There we go. 4 to 1 ratio, I'd say that's pretty good. We do need to make sure you can be independent again though. Also stop sieging down my... Uh... Well actually no, that's fine. There'll be a whiny population over there anyway, so... Oh yeah. We're actually standing on the other side of the island. Never mind. Arabia. Who shall rule? Not a democrat. Who is super loyal? You, my friend. Congratulations. Enjoy. So, Carthage, if you could ally someone, that would be great. Okay? Right. So now ship you over here and surprise surprise there'll be another three troops crushing the ever-living crap out of you there we go we are fighting quite a lot of people I'd say <laughs> I think it's the yeah pretty much all of the Iberian Peninsula ah well Mm, but we're no longer a dictator. We could um, dictator ourselves again. Yeah. I mean, I still need the achievement for. Um, where is it? Refusing to give up power, and she is pretty amazing. Uh, you can be independent. Which I'm sure means go and hide in a harbor somewhere, but we'll see. Right. We've, okay, yeah, we're crushing. We'll crush that army. Um, you lot need to be independent as well, though. So let's have that going straight away. There you go. Enjoy. Oh, right. Nice. Stack wipe. Oh, this is literally it. So we do have the... Yeah, we do have the ticking war score. <laughs> um, Remexios, what are you complaining about? You are dying, so I'll happily give you free hands. Enjoy. And then you can even keep those free hands to the grave. That sounded a bit morbid. Anyway. Okay, okay. Commands mass. Oh, what? Oh, really? Go deal with them? Yes. Okay, good, good, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Barbarians, something, something, something. Uh, 
<laughs> really? Are they really that crap? Ah, oh, this is kind of amusing. They're like three times the amount of troops, but no, we'll just crush them anyway. Uh, probably not if those manage to. Yeah, we can definitely do some games if those manage to reinforce in time. Let's get the money. Okay, barbarians have been defeated. All is great. There we go. You are coming in there on the 2nd of April. Okay, we'll be gone by then. All right, hopefully you come and take care of that army because that is actually quite large. So not super keen on having to fight it. Well, not with that stack. I am very keen on you're not going there. I'm very keen on fighting it with this army. Yeah, that is fine. This, not so much. You'll be there in five days. You have 13, Marshall. This guy has how much? 15. Okay, we can't change the tactics. Oh, just get in there and deal with that. That battle is fine. Luckily, he's using stupid tactics anyway, so... Enjoy! But there are a lot of troops here. Right, independent. Okay, stack wipe. I'll uh, happily take that. Doesn't look like we can piece anyone out just yet. Um, it would be three years. I don't think we can occupy everything before that, so... We'll just have to wait for those years to pass before we can um, start piecing people out. And after that, I think we'll take this. More or less this. Not this one here, because that, that doesn't look like it's going to be part of... Uh, part of the map. But yeah, apart from that, this is looking pretty sweet. So this guy... Oh, that's this guy, right? No, it isn't. So this is a separate one. So this one might be able to just piece out. Nice tactician there as well. Because everything here should fall. No, it's not all falling automatically. Okay, go and siege that one down. And then, jeez, calm down, game. Right, we need a new whatever this is. You look fantastic. Ah, oh, that's a tax guy. Right. Independent. So we can piece out this guy. I would like for you to be a um, sure, client state. There we go. It's no harming having a couple of more subjects anyway. Alright, these ones are going to fall automatically. Obviously, they don't realize it, so they've decided to go and siege those things down anyway. And in the meantime, we'll just keep crushing their armies. Alright, we're already 49 war score, which is pretty nice. I presume we've gotten quite a lot from battles. Ah, oh, 13. Yeah, take it. Auritania is low now. Corencia, whoever you are. Are you someone up there? Oh, we might actually be able to piece you out as well. If this is all you own. Which it does look like it is. Oh my god. Oh, too many diplomatic relations now. Well! There we go. Easily sorted. More research. Anything else? Not going to do this.
Oh, wait. Yeah. Not quite sure. I, I, I misread that previously. It's definitely something we want to do. And prosperity. I mean, uh, we don't need money. For once, you're going to get to keep your one point of popularity. Let's get the stability rolling. Ah, it's beautiful. Everything is back to being perfect in the great land of the Eastern Roman Empire. Victory after victory as we spill the blood of our enemies on the battlefield. What? Oh, did we die? Well, that's a shame. No. Did I forget to renew the terms? Oh, that's a shame. All right, then. Uh, I think we had eight. No, I don't see it. Where are we? What do we have? Yeah, we do have eight. Am I being blind? Are we already needing something else? I don't know what, what she's in charge of the oh she's in charge of the navy. Well, that seems um, problem is I dismiss her and now I'm not going to be able to add her to this army because of stupidity. I'm quite sure. Look at the bottom here. Yeah, no, can't be done. How loyal are you? Uh, you're still reasonably loyal. Okay, keep you there for now. I'm sure you will get disloyal before long though. Okay, that siege is done. Uh, that means we should be able to piece you out very, very shortly. Question is, do we want... Alright, calm down. Uh, do we want you to be a subject as well? Tributaries don't take up relation slots. So let's just make you a tributary. There we go. Also, let's just double check that I haven't got anyone forced marching because that... Would not surprise me while oh, you're fighting. No, it's all looking good. Right, onwards and upwards then. Now the thing is, um, could potentially just piece you out, so we want that one, and then we want that one, and that one. Is that what we said? Looks a bit weird there. Reset. Let's try again. So, two for peace. We want you, you, you. There's a fort. Ah, we haven't got that fort yet. Yeah, I think we want that one as well and not that thing up there. So, we do need to siege that one down. Um, How about you? You go for that fort. Yeah, it's only a level one fort, so. And once that is done, we can piece these guys out. We don't need any more claims on Carthage, do we? I mean, do we have claims on you? We already have a claim on you. Do we have a claim on you? No. I guess that will save a bit of war score. Carthage, the only thing we want from you is that thing up there. 
So that's not going to cost anything. Apart from that, it's really just... Um, what's the word? It's just um, colonizing. Now, is there a clever way we can actually do the colonization here? If we can get a bunch of propontic people over here. Alright, move pop here. There's two here. Two. Three. Carmite Propontic. Sure. There's another one. Oh my god. <laughs> Druidic Propontic? Probably fine as well. Hellenic Propontic, yes. Jesus Christ. Hellenic Propontic. There's too many of them. Hellenic Propontic. Is that enough of them now? Yes, it is. Okay. Colonize you. And then move pops here. Ah, Hellenic. That's enough, apparently. Alright, there we go. That's that part sorted. Um, what else do we need to colonize? We need to colonize here, and we need to colonize here. Uh, this is going to be a bit trickier. Let's just... Oh, good luck with that. Paper <laughs> ran away after like one day. Uh, right, yeah. We need you to siege that down ASAP. And then we can piece these guys out. And then when can we declare war on you again? Really? We have no CB against Carthage? I mean, it's fine. We can just declare on these guys. Truce is up. 62. Five more years. I mean, we're almost at the level of stab, but we can take another stab hit. Not quite sure whether you can go into negative stability, though. Maybe worth testing. Uh, yeah, for sure. Oh, we've already done that one now as well. Okay. So, here we want this, 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 and this. Yeah. Actually, we want that as well. Oh, that's too tricky to see. All of that, I think. And then we'll take that in the next war. All right. Yeah. Any objections? No, you are super happy about that. Excellent. All your stuff belongs to us. So, question is then... Um, Should we take a stab hit to go to war with Byzantium? Probably, but I think we'll leave that for the next episode. What I want to do now is check whether I can get this freaking thing colonized. We need to get enough Propontic people over here. And I'm not sure whether we have any. Well, I mean, it's both the wrong religion and everything. Should we try and colonize here or complain? Yeah, dominant culture is not integrated culture. Okay. 
Right. We do have some Propontic people down here. Can we get more Propontic people here? There must be a better way of doing this. Aha! Hellenic Propontic. Come here. Should be filters or something. <laughs> Hellenic Punic? Not quite. We've Canite Propontic. We can't. How about here? Um, who pops here? Carnite Propontic. Punic Hellenic. Punic Hellenic. Have a Propontic Hellenic there. Now it's a. This is. Well, I'm not going to lie. This is not the greatest um, user interface for this. I'd say. Okay, we have Hellenic Propontic here at least. Because how can we move? Can I move from this one, for instance? Not quite sure how far we can move these guys. Because I need to, we need to. Well, we have colonized this crap down here. Cyrenaican. Lenic Propontic. Alright, let's have a look. Move pops here. Lenic Propontic. Lenic Propontic. Lenic Propontic. I think we can make this work. I'm not sure whether that would be interesting enough to watch though. I'll have a think about that. I'll, I'll look into this between the episodes, but I think we can sort of, I don't know, basically take troops from, well, of course we can. We can always move troops from here to here to here to here to here, you know, move them all around here to get them to be able to colonize down here. Um, hopefully we don't need to do it in that sort of scale, but uh, I'll have a look between the episodes and see what the best way forward is. I'm not sure I'll record the actual moving because that's probably going to be, well, as boring as watching setting up all of these um, trade routes, which I'm not going to do anymore. We're almost there anyway. So, we're going to finish this episode here. As always, um, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye!